Join me as I dive into the crazy details surrounding Little Dirk's arrest and try to connect the dots the mysterious Bible verse makes. Matthew chapter 5, verses 21 to 22. There's no doubt that Little Dirk's recent arrest has sent shockwaves throughout the music industry. And it's not just because of the serious allegations against him. What's got everyone talking is the unexpected connection to specific Bible verse, Matthew chapter 5, verse 21 to 22 in the Christian community, which has left many wondering if there's more to the story than meets the eye. Little Dirk is facing some serious charges, including a murder plot that allegedly took place in Los Angeles. Prosecutors claim that he conspired to murder. If found guilty, he could be facing some serious time behind bars. Even more surprising is that this isn't the first time Little Dirk has faced legal troubles. He has had a string of run-ins with the law, from drug charges to probation violations. It is clear that this arrest is a major blow to his career. But the question on everyone's mind is this led up to this point. The details of the alleged murder plot are still unfolding. What we do know is that Little Dirk and his associates are accused of planning and carrying out a brutal attack. The victim, allegedly a member of the rival gang, was left dead. It's a miracle that he survived. But what even is more chilling is that the attack was allegedly planned in retaliation for a previous shooting that took place earlier in 2020. It's a tit-for-tat cycle of violence that left a trail of destruction in its wake. As the investigation continues, more and more evidence is coming to light, including a stunning piece of testimony from the confidential informant, according to the reports. The, the informant claims to have been present during the planning stages of the attack, and has provided critical information to the authorities. But what is still unclear is how this all connects to Matthew chapter 5, verses 21 to 22, the Bible verse that has been mentioned in connection with this case. We'll spoil that at the end, so stick around. So let's dive into the details surrounding the case. According to sources close to the investigation, the evidence against Little Dirk is mounting including surveillance footage and eyewitness testimony. But what, what's really got everyone talking is the alleged connection in Matthew chapter 5, verse 21 to 22, which reads, You have heard that it was said to those of old, You shall not murder, or whoever murders will be in danger of judgment. But I say, if you are even angry with someone, you are subject to judgment. If you call someone an idiot of being brought before the court, and if you curse someone, you are in danger of fires of hell. It's clear that the prosecution is trying to build a case that Little Dirk's actions were premeditated and calculating. But what's still unclear is now is how this Bible verse fits into the longer narrative. As we dig deeper into the evidence, one thing is clear. This case is full of twists and turns, but perhaps the most compelling piece of evidence comes from the secretly recording conversation between Little Dirk and one of his associates. In the recording, Little Dirk allegedly discusses a plan for the attack, including the target and the means by which they would carry it out. It's a stunning piece of evidence that could be a key to securing a conviction, but what still is unclear is why Little Dirk's legal team has been pushing back so hard against the allegation. According to sources close to the case, Little Dirk team is claiming that the evidence against him is circumstantial at best and that the prosecution case is built on shaky ground. It is clear that this case is far from over and there are still many questions that need to be answered. In conclusion, the arrest of Little Dirk is a major scandal that left many in the music industry reeling. From the serious allegation against him to the cryptic connection to Matthew chapter 5, verse 21 to 22, there is no denying that this case is full of intrigue and drama. So now let's take a look and let's go deeper into Matthew chapter 5, verses 21 to 22. And it reads, You have heard that our ancestors were told, you must not murder. 
And if you commit murder, you are subject to judgment. But I say, if you are even angry with someone, you are subject to judgment. If you call someone an idiot, you are in danger of being brought before the court. And if you curse someone, you are in danger of the fires of hell. The Life Application Study Bible says this greatly to explain it. Killing is a terrible sin, but anger is a great sin too, because it also violates God's command to love. Anger in this case refers to the seething, brooding bitterness against someone. It is a dangerous emotion that always threatens to leap out of control, leading to violence, emotional hurt, increasing mental stress, and spiritual damage. Anger keeps us from developing a spirit pleasing to God. Have you ever been proud that you didn't strike out and say what was really on your mind? Self-control is good, but Christ wants us to practice thought control as well. Jesus says that we will be held accountable even for our attitudes. But as this case continues to unfold, one thing is clear. Little Dirk's career is hanging in the balance and the outcome of this trial have serious consequences for his future. I want to thank you for tuning in and let me know your thoughts on this situation in the comment section below. Don't forget to hit that like button and subscribe for more videos on current events and celebrity news. God bless you, bless your family, and I'll see you in the next. Thanks.